Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to add a PDF download link to your view in Gravity View. So as you can see, I've got this view set up here. It's a table layout and it's displaying different projects. So we've got the project title, the team lead, and then the email address of the team lead. So what we want to do is add a link here in the table that allows us to download a PDF about that project. So in other words, the PDF will contain information about that entry. So the first thing we need to do is download and install the Gravity PDF add-on for Gravity Forms. So Gravity PDF, basically, um, when you set it up, every time you get an entry submitted, uh, it'll save that as a PDF file. So to download Gravity PDF, just head over to wordpress.org, uh, search for Gravity PDF, in the plugin directory, download the zip file, and then uh, upload it to your site. And um, yeah, go ahead and activate it. So after you've done that, you'll need to create a new PDF feed. So the way to do that is just to head over to your WordPress admin, hover over forms, click on forms. And then you want to hover over your form and then hover over the settings link and then scroll down and click on PDF. Okay, so as you can see, we don't have a PDF feed set up yet, so we'll add a new one. All right, so let's give it a label. Uh, we'll just call it Project Reports. We can also select a template here. There's a few different options. And then we'll add the file name. So here we can actually use Gravity Forms merge tags. So I'm gonna actually select the Project Title merge tag. And that will ensure that each PDF has a different title depending on the project title, which is quite nice. And as you can see, there's actually loads of other options here. Lots of settings and, and things to play around with um, for customizing the look and feel of your PDF files. So make sure you play around with that. Um, but for this example, we'll just keep things simple and I'll save this feed. Okay, so that is saved. And the next step is to add a PDF download link in our view that downloads the PDF for a single entry. All right, so now we need to add a PDF download link to our view. And to do that, we'll need to use the Gravity PDF shortcode. So as you can see, there's actually a button here called Copy Shortcode. Uh, we'll just click on that and that'll copy it to the clipboard. And then we need to head over to our view. So I've got my view editor open here. And then just scroll down to where you want to add the PDF download link and click Add Field. And then select Custom Content. All right, so open the Custom Content settings by clicking on the gear icon. And as you can see, this is the Custom Content text editor. Now you want to actually paste in that Gravity PDF shortcode like that. So that's, uh, that's basically it. So we just need to click outside to save it and then scroll up and update our view. Okay, now we can head back over to our view on the front end and refresh the page. And as you can see, we've got a new column here with a PDF download link on the right. So if you just click on that, It'll actually download the PDF report straight to your uh, machine. You can double click to open it. And uh, there you go. As you can see, we've got a PDF file containing all the details for that specific project.